today uh, we're gonna have uh, four presenters from different countries. Uh, the first presentation is gonna be about the IR in a chronic pelvic pain, and um, we're gonna ask Dr. Maciej Schmigin from Poland uh, to present this uh, topic. After that, we're gonna have a uh, one clinical case, which is gonna be presented by, uh, by uh, Dr. Monika Zbroja, also from Poland. Uh, the next Part is going to be IR management of uterine fibroids, and uh, they're going to be a representative from Italy, Dr. Francesco Giuraza. Uh, and uh, the clinical case is going to be presented uh, by uh, Dr. Alessandro Punti. To sum up, uh, we know that proper clinical and imaging diagnostic is crucial. It's very important in patients with chronic pelvic pain because they search help for many years. Uh, the patient was qualified for endovascular treatment. For a few months, she underwent a set of a uh, few embolization procedures which decreased pain. However, uh, there was a progressive insufficiency of uh, venous collaterals leading to recurrence of the symptoms of the pain. So embolizations had to be repeated. The patient can be sent by the gynecologist, even if, to be honest, almost in Italy is not so frequent because surgeons usually prefer surgical approaches. Many patients come to us because they speak with other patients already treated with embolization or they look on Google and they find embolization. Actually, the contrast enhanced magnetic resonance in a T1 sequence where uh, multiple fibroids are evident. The major one, this one, in five centimeters in maximum diameter. 